Welcome to technical drawing. Today we'll see this sum in oblique. Now in this sum scale is 2 is to 1. That means we have to divide, we have to multiply all dimensions with 2 and then we have to solve. Length is 40. So here we'll take 80. The width is 40. So we'll take 80. And height is 75. So we'll take double which is 150. So first we will draw layout. After drawing layout, if you see in side view the entire thing is 1. So we'll start with that part. So this is how much? 20. We'll take 20 from here and then we'll go down by 60. Because over here it has meant, uh, they have mentioned it is 30. So I'm going down by 60. Now whatever I will draw it on this left side of side view, left hand side view. The same thing will come on right side also. So what we need to do, we need to draw a horizontal line of 80, 80 mm each. From here, I will take again 20. See this. This height is 25 mm. So I'll, up, I'll go up by 50. I'll draw a line like this, which is 20. And from here, we'll draw this line. Then from here, we'll draw horizontal line, horizontal line, and from here also horizontal line. Then from here, we'll draw line like this. This is 80. Again, we'll draw a line like this. Then we'll go up. We'll join this slope. See this, this part is done. After that, if you see this radius, radius is 20. So we'll take 40, 40. So we'll go down by 40 from this left hand side top corner and we'll go inside by 40. So you take radius 40 and you draw a curve. Then you take this point behind by 20 and again you draw radius 40. You can draw tangent. See this. You take radius 40. You go behind by 20. And you draw radius 40. Remember I am multiplying all dimensions by 2 while drawing it. But we don't have to multiply angle. If there is some slope of 30 degree, we don't have to multiply that by 2. So we are done with this much part. After that, you will join this. Now, after drawing all these lines dark, then this is 10, 10 mm on both the sides. So we'll mark 20, 20 on both the sides. From bottom we'll take 10, so that is 20. 
and we'll draw this part now we know that this is hollow so we'll we'll extend this behind and this height is how much 10 plus 25 35 so 70 we'll mark this point always remember to mark on the main box then you transfer it on the inclined surface so this is 20 from here also it is 20 this will be dark and this will be dark now after this we need to take this line behind remember this line will go inside by 80 so you can cross check if it is 80 See, it is less than eighty, so it will come like this. In case width is short, so then the vertical line will come. Now, see here also, we'll draw radius seven, so that is fourteen. We'll draw a circle, and from this point, center point, we need to go behind by twenty, and again we need to draw radius fourteen. see this you take that radius you go behind by 20 and again you draw radius so it will come like this so i hope you people have understood this thank you